Today's comment of the day award goes to Connor Sheenan who says Tom every day you cheer me up I'm so glad every time you see that you have uploaded I've been here since 10k subs I'm a man in Manchester United fan but it doesn't stop me watching the Liverpool career board all kinds of fans are welcome on my channel and I really hope that you guys enjoy the videos. I will make a lot more awesome videos in the near future. I really hope that you guys like the increase in the quality. I'm, a, I'm also in the process of purchasing a new camera where, with a lot higher quality that I can record football challenge videos with my friends because you guys absolutely love the fan zone videos. I want to get my friends involved even more with my youtube channel so we will do football challenges and everything else that you guys want to see so leave your suggestions right now in the comments below what kind of videos do you want to see me do with my friends what is up guys it's tom here and welcome back to the liverpool career world show with a brand new episode and guys it's the champions league quarterfinals thank you so much for your awesome support on the previous episodes if you want to see more videos like this smash that like button and i could do a double upload of liverpool carrier mode tomorrow if you guys get this video to like 400 likes so go ham on the likes and yes we are in the quarterfinals this is going to be huge Bayern munich already beat dortmund at home and man city won in valencia so it's a vital that we get a good result and i'm out for revenge because juventus have actually beaten us in the champions league final if you remember two seasons ago, Alex Teixeira, who is now a Liverpool player, scored two goals in that game. So I want my revenge, but Alex Teixeira is very tired, so he won't play in this game, maybe in the return leg. So this is my strongest possible lineup that I could field, because uh, yeah, we have a couple of really tired players. Here we go boys, Juventus against Liverpool in the beautiful Juventus Stadium. This is such a big game, I'm so up for this. We need to score a away goal, I will try to win this game. But even a, a loss where we score an away goal might not be the worst result. And let's check out the Juventus team. So they have David De Gea, this will be very hard to break down. Mandzukic and Morata up front. And they have Coutinho. As you, you may remember, the board sold Coutinho on the last hour of the transfer deadline day in the summer. I had no say in that, so I'm really, really hoping that Coutinho doesn't show up in this game and score goals against us. This is beautiful. Oh, this is... Klein! Bang! Oh, blocked. No. No, no, no. Don't let him in. Great save. Ter Stegen has been brilliant. Come on. Beauty! What the hell? No! Come on. Come on, Royce. Beautiful! Oh, Jack Henderson! Please? Gotcha! Your time to shine! The hell again. Go on. Go on, Dybala. Against your former team. And... Oh, what are you doing? Okay, Gotcha. Come on, Chrissy! I can't believe what is this Juventus defense on? Are you kidding me, Mandzukic? What an incredible world class save by Ter Stegen! I thought he would score. What a save! Oh, what on earth! Oh, oh, Dybala might be in. Surely! Yes! Marco Reus makes it 1-0. It's a sweaty goal, but I don't care what is David Lewis doing. Trying to read that pass. And Marco Reus just swaps it home into the far post. This is such an important goal. Because it's an away goal. Ah, that Ter Stegen save at the end of the first half is now even more important. We have a lot of very, very tired players, especially Götze is on his knees, so let's bring on Emre Can. Let's bring on Shovun for Xko, and Royce is also quite tired, so Nunez comes on as a super sub. No, 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 no. No, come on! Are you kidding? 
what a goal. They completely outplayed my defense there. And it hurts seeing Coutinho being involved. Oh man, that's just a rebound and that's... Yeah. That is a fantastic passing move. Honestly, they completely outdone, outdone my defense there. Come on! No! I missed it. Wow. You guys! Oh! No! No! The hell! Go away! Oh, Nunez! Nunez! I mean, show me! Can he? No, he can't. Klein, please, Klein! No! Are you kidding me? They hit the post! What a tense close game! I'm actually very happy with the draw because Juventus had the better chances, I felt. They hit the bar, and yeah, I, I also had uh, some chances. I also hit the bar, I think, or the post. But De uh, Ter Stegen and De Gea, the two goalkeepers, were outstanding. And it's all to play for in the second leg. And Paulo Dybala coming back against his former club gets a man of the match performance. So these are the players that you can see above me that I'm training this week. Nunez keeps improving and hopefully Harley can get his rating up to 78 rating. And McDonald is also improving very nicely. So let's see how their rating goes up well not not a lot by actually but but they are they are improving very nicely these guys so barcelona have beaten paris saint germain 3 one so these are the first leg results i think it's wide open who goes through in the second legs but now let's turn our attention to the premier league we are five points clear of arsenal with just six games to go we cannot bottle this but i have to change the side a lot because we have uh, quite a few very tired players in our squad. But let's hope this team is still good enough to pick up the three points or at least a draw here. Aib, Origi and Nunez starts up front. I have to rotate the team to keep players fresh for the Juventus second leg. Let's go guys! Selhurst Park. I have nightmares about this ground. So let's banish them and let's win here. I hope that this will not be a disastrous game as usual for Liverpool. We still have the best defensive record in the Premier League. Arsenal conceded second least amount of goals. Manchester United third. Oh, Ibe is in! Please Ibe, finish it! No, man! Why do I keep hitting the bar? Oh, Wickham is in! Oh my word, he missed it. Come on. Oh, it's Nunez time! Please, Nunez. Finish it! Are you kidding me? Oh, my... My... <laughs> my controller died. Okay, so let's find out what happened. It's actually another... Instance where we hit the bar. I cannot believe that, guys. Oh, Bolassi. That could have been a pen. Watch this. Uh, that's not the best place to stop it. I think it was closer than that to the line. Oh, yes. Yes. Yes, I... B one good touch. Surely you can finish it. No. I can't. I need to make some substitutions. Henderson comes on for Emre Can. And you know what? Let's bring on Teixeira for Danny Heard And maybe... Yeah, Marco Royce for Jordan Ibe to add more firepower up front. Oh, hardly! Ah, oh, the right back almost scored. I can't believe how many chances I have in this one. Come on. Please. Surely, Nunez, you can score this. It hits the post. Why? No. I like it. Come on, Gomez. Bang! Royce! Oh, man! Come on. Nunez? Teixeira! Are you... What the hell is this game? I hit the frame of the goal four times. No! This is a travesty! And watch, watch Crystal Palace win it. Oh, Bolasi with the party tricks. Brilliant! Just EA 
Thank you very much for this game. Just fantastic. No, God! I hit the bar, I hit the post in total of four times. And Butland, I didn't call him out. He just comes out for no reason. And then he can't save a shot, which is going in the middle of the goal. Well done, EA. Well done. Just the perfect game. Just what we needed in the title race. No, God, please, no! 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 Previously, I would have been, I would have raged so hard, but it's just, it's just so bad. It's actually funny how this game went. I mean, I, I hit the post, I hit the bar, I hit the frame of the goal four times. Look at those stats. And Crystal Palace, one goal, one goalkeeping mistake by Botland, and I think. We will buy Karius in the summer and we will sell Butland because it's just not good enough. You you can't play for Liverpool if you make mistakes like that. And to be honest, I had a brilliant game. Nunez should have scored. Alex Teixeira should have scored. We got very lucky with the results because as you can see, Arsenal failed to take advantage of us losing. They could only draw 1-1 against Swansea at home, which is brilliant. So that means that we are still four points ahead of Arsenal with five games to go. And if I play like I played in the previous game, then I will win a lot of games. So I'm confident that I can take this title back to Anfield once again. And yeah, the top four race is going down to the wire. It looks like Chelsea will finish in the top four, but Man United and Man City and even Swansea City are battling it out. And uh, here you can see the bottom of the table sides. West Ham are in trouble with Watford and Cardiff City. And here are the top scorers in the Premier League. As you can see, Boney is the top scorer with Oscar second. Dybala has 11 goals. And good news is that our left back Robertson, who is our best fullback at the club, accepted our contract offer. So he will stay at Liverpool for a, for a long time. And Daniel Hurd sprained his ankle. He's out for three weeks. But I think we can have, uh, we have enough replacements. It's the next game, the next episode will be a cracker. Liverpool against Juventus. If you want to see that tomorrow and if you want to see a lot of career mode episodes tomorrow, smash the like button. Thanks for watching. See you later. Have a lovely day. Goodbye.